guys, and welcome to another edition of the Creation Corner where we try to make something out of nothing. Today I'm going to show you how I made a jetpack. I used a couple of empty plastic bottles, um, some cardboard that I had uh, cut and stripped, uh, more cardboard, I love me some cardboard, um, some tools here that I'm going to need is a little cordless screwdriver, some snips, uh, some kind of tubing, uh, more cardboard that I've already pre-cut, tape measure if you need it, for cutting straight edges. I've also got some 20 ounce bottle caps, duct tape, masking tape, either one will work, uh, screws, uh, and then a little $1 tap light. And we're going to take all this plus a cardboard box, which is already pre-cut and painted, and my good old water bottle from the Booba Fabricator. Just don't tell Billy Joe, he won't like it. So now we're going to take all of these, put them together, and make a jetpack. Now here, I've already taken my, well, here's some more tools you'll need. A pair of scissors and a razor blade. And here, I've already taken my razor blade and cut out my hole for my water bottle. And just set it in there, nice and neat. Now, I don't know how well you can see it, but here, I went ahead and drilled me some holes for my tubing to go into. Next, I take the spray painted bottles with um, lids. I cut a hole in the lid for, for the tubing. One of the items I forgot to mention you'll need is some glue. I'm using Gorilla Glue. Because gorillas are people too. <laughs> so now I'm going to take the bottle, which I painted yellow, and drill a hole in the side and place one of the smaller tubes that I painted silver in the side. And I'll take my Gorilla Glue, put it along the side of the bottle. and then place it, the other end of the tubing into the hole that I drilled in the water bottle, and place it on the so that I can glue it to the other side. I'll do the same with the second bottle. You adjust them, you get them the right height, right distance from the middle. Press it down, make sure it's good and tight. And this is what it looks like so far. I will let those dry and move on. Now I'll take the three bottle caps that I've already painted. And these are more decorative pieces, I guess. And again, we'll add our glue. Place them on our box. And while this dries, we'll uh, we're gonna work on the wings. Can't have a jetpack without wings. So went ahead and cut out my wings and painted them. The nice little silver and a little navy blue. And two of them. They'll go in the sides. So now I'll take. My longer pieces of tubing, which I already have the, uh, the holes drilled into the box, slide them down in there and plug it into the yellow bottles. 
and there we go. <clears throat> so now I'll take my wings where I've already cut a, a slot into the side of the box and place my wings inside the slot. And we'll do the same for the other side. Now, we'll take the back side of the box and place it on the back so that we can attach our straps. And this is where the duct tape will come in handy. I'm going to just take tape the back side down so that it'll stay in place. There we go. So now we'll take our circular pieces that we've already pre-cut, our straps, which are also pre-cut, <coughs> and we'll attach them to the box. And for a final decorative piece, we'll take our one dollar tap light, apply our glue. and place it on top. And now we'll let it dry. Well, now all of our parts have dried, and we have a jetpack. So there you go, guys. Hope that helped you out. Remember, if you have a challenge for me, you can post a comment down below, or you can uh, send me a PM on Facebook. Um, rate, subscribe, all that good stuff. Blessed be. I got to go.